Yeah, this is the cable I want to use for the extension. Uh, it was recovered from a Camry hybrid. This is the cable that carried the voltage from the back of the car to the front. And I have the mission of using this cable. So follow me as I start the process of getting it done. So after clearing the back, the car is still not yet jacked up, so I need to lower this in there to get it later. I'm not cutting the cable yet. I'm not cutting the cable yet, but I'm just going to fit it in and then open the lower part to get it out from there. Okay. It is time for me to make a decision of where to actually get my source, the point of connection to this battery. I can do this place and this place. And I can also trace that cable, that big cable, that one, this one that I'm tracing back, it comes all the way. To this point yes I can do this place and that junction over there the most appropriate place will have been those two points over there but I'm looking at the cable and also the point of entry to this casing should be this highest point of the casing which is right at the top here when I mean at the top this is the highest part of the casing so the middle hop here should be the best place to get entrance into the casing. Okay. Okay. Looking at the casing, that means this spot. But the former, in my first conversion, I used this inlet that I already made. From this inlet, I gain entrance using each of them, one, two, into the casing but this time around this guy they are protected i'm looking at taking the highest point up here to gain entrance into the casing with the help of this guy i don't think it's big enough but that's i can find the other one but i'm going to start with that it is very important that you insulate the battery from the car. I have the rubber mat underneath this and that's how I'm insulating it. I have this one in and I'm gonna put the other one in later. All right. It is necessary to insulate this block of batteries, but it is not compulsory. When you start having our voltage leakage to the body then you will realize what I'm saying but this is how I'm doing mine after each layer I am using this material that is actually the yoga mat this is what I found this time around the yoga mat and I'm using it to insulate each of the block of a battery from one another concluding part of the arrangement of the battery in the trunk I use this resettable fuse with 250 amps in conjunction with this fuse to put it at the back. Everything you're looking at all together make one battery which is connected in parallel with the one that comes from the trunk. This is where I join the two of them together. The one up here, you can see the cable. One cable goes to that end hand over there and the other cable goes here on this block while the other cable on this block goes to the back and this one comes back from the back into this fuse from this fuse to that end and there you have it and this is the other cable that is from the battery underneath the car the two of them in parallel and that's what I did this gives me good mileage i only use this rod to hold it together 
and uh, when I tried to tie this thing down to the body of the car, I was getting high voltage leakage to the body. And that, and that was not good because high voltage must not get to the 12 volt that runs the electronics of the car. So I had to insulate the whole thing, the whole thing that I have here, I had to insulate it from the car. And since then, I've been enjoying it. This degraded battery with the one underneath the car is also degraded. And the two degraded batteries giving me 80 miles, 80 usable miles, which is more than enough for me to go to work and come back home on a, on a daily basis. If you like what you see, please subscribe, share, and like. I want to improve on this. I want people to give me comment that can help me to improve on it. I want it. I like it. As it is right now, it's actually more than enough for what I want right now. But guess what? I cannot get out of my bubbles of 80 miles. And I want to get out of that bubble. But right now, it's okay. Please like, share, and subscribe to encourage me to do more of this. Alright, have a good one.